Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. Um, I want to show here the fruits of a couple of days of work. Um, I'm doing this to learn Hebrew through YouTube or improve my vocab. And basically what this is, is how to use a third party app. In this case, I'm using something called Z Translate to auto generate captions in your language, in my case, English, even if the YouTube video doesn't have auto captions in that language. So let me show you guys um, what I'm talking about. I built out this huge YouTube playlist um, of videos that have Hebrew subtitles and they're in Hebrew. So if I go into one video, let's uh, go to, I don't know, something professional, professionally produced. Now I'm obviously recording this video here on my Android. So this is the mobile user interface um, and not the web one. So this exists on the web but there's an inconsistency. So if I turn on the, if I click on the subtitle icon and I can go into captions, I have either no captions or Hebrew. There is, there are Hebrew captions on this. Now, when I'm using the uh, desktop or the web UI, I have a button called auto translate. Um, and clicking on that icon, if there is one caption file in whatever language, you can auto translate into any language. For whatever reason, it's not available on Android. Even, even if you click on device settings, it just doesn't work for me. So I figured out sort of a workaround and the workaround is by using a third party app called V Recorder. I'm sure there are other ways I'm just showing in this video a way that does work. So what you wanna do is click share on the video that you're trying to have the captions translate. Then you click on Z translate and then, and then this app called Z translate kind of parses the video. Uh, now it may not be working because uh, I'm not actually sure what this is. Maybe it's some like adware or something. I'm going to just try this again. Click on share. Click on Z translate. And here we go. And now I've opened the same video I want to see in Z translate. Let's just skip forward a bit. So you can see I'm now I'm now getting the subtitles in English and I'm gonna just go out and maximize the view for a second actually I can only do it maximized in this orientation on my tablet so I had to configure the app such that I told it that my main language or the you know it was gonna be Hebrew into English but once I've inputted the setting it can read the subtitles off in Hebrew and it will auto generate them in English even when the YouTube app uh doesn't allow me to do that so that's basically it that's how it works i uh, hope this is useful thanks for watching have a good day